The Isley Gallery is opening the Art of the National Parks Exhibition this Friday. And joining me this morning, well, we've got a full lineup. We've got Jennifer Gallant, Chuck Marshall, and Mike Retzlaff. This is, uh, sounds like a very cool event. Jennifer, tell me a little bit about uh, what's going on with this exhibition. Yeah, so we're really excited. We've brought in artists um, from around the nation to internationally. Um, they are all depicting, um, they all have paintings depicting national parks around the nation and internationally as well. We have big paintings, small paintings, and a lot of these artists haven't showed in the Midwest before. And this is uh, really special because some of the art, uh, I mean, like, like Chuck, you've got a chance to paint in these national parks. Definitely. I'd imagine just, I mean, they're known for the breathtaking scenery. What a better place to, uh, to go out and practice your art than, uh, than right there. It's heaven. I love it. And I, I can't wait to get back out to uh, the Tetons this summer. T tell me some of the places you've been, some of the places that will be featured in some of the paintings on this display. Um, I have th um, three places featured in this show. Um, the Tetons, uh, the Wind River Range, which is Bridger National Forest, and then uh, Canyon de Chez, which is also a national park down in Arizona. But um, I, I, I've traveled all over the country. I've uh, National parks in Maine, Arizona, California, you know, the whole bit. I haven't gotten to all of them, but I'm, I'm working on it. Yeah, I mean, just some uh, breathtaking landscapes, and we're showing some of the art here on the screen, and, and some of the, uh, the work of, uh, of artists in the field. That's just fantastic to be able to get out there and do that. This is all going for a good cause. We've got the uh, Mike from the SPCA here. This is gonna help you guys out, right? And you've, you've, you've brought a friend. We've brought a friend, yes, and we wanna thank the gallery for uh, picking us to, to be the charity of, of choice uh, to get some of the proceeds this coming Friday the 12th, so uh, we'll have a little guy similar to this probably uh, at the gallery on Friday, but for now, look at Biscuit. Biscuit, look at the camera. Biscuit's seven, <laughs> there we go. Beautiful, isn't he? He's seven years old. He, he's in really good shape for seven years old. He's a Maltese mix. He'll be up for adoption today at noon at our Sharonville facility, 11,900 Conray Road, so. Excellent. Jen, as far as the art exhibit goes, where is this happening? What do people need to know about uh, about getting there? Yeah, so this is in Fairfax at our gallery, right off of 50, just 15 minutes east of the city. Um, so we have a parking lot, so it's really easy, easily accessible, um, and it's on the 12th, 5 to 8. Okay. Um, yeah, there'll be... It's a lot of great stuff there. Right across from the Mainliner. You've <laughs> yeah. got the opening reception yeah. for the uh, the Art of the National Parks exhibit on the 12th, 8 uh, to, uh, from 5 to 8, rather, at the Isley Gallery. The event's free to attend. The exhibit's going to be open April 12th until May 25th. Plenty of opportunity for you to get out and uh, take in some of this beautiful art and take it home with you.